Hello, my name is Walter Bresky. It's now moving in the eighth month of this LSC not responding to me with the internal accounts documents I requested and FOIA requests. Will those documents ever be sent to me or will this continue to be a dodge by this LSC? Next, why does this LSC's officers continue to allow repeated open meeting meetings act violations? The most recent violation was voting to accept the resignation of two parents reps at the April 27th meeting without the vote being listed on the meeting's agenda, nor was it listed under new or old business on the agenda for just a conversation to be had on the resignations. The resignations vote was approved and it allowed only for the budget to be passed, which is with seven, not eight votes. If this wasn't the first time items not listed on the LSC's meeting agenda were voted on, at his time as LSC, I'm sorry, and this wasn't the first time items not listed on the LSC meetings agenda were not voted on at an LSC meeting. Oddly, a fundraiser proposed for vote by Skynet's AD uh, at an early school year LSC meeting wasn't approved because the LSC chair said it wasn't on the agenda. Can the individuals running the Steinus LSC please share with everyone their own rules for meetings and for responding to the FOIA requests? In addition, it was disingenuous for a member to respond to assertions that LSC members are being wrongly accused of being related to others. Mr. Duckworth, time is up. 